How many points make a straight line? Yes, Kaloy. Ah, uh, ma'am, we need at least two points to draw a line. Tulid nga nasabi ni Kaloy, kailangan natin ng dalawang point para makagawa ng isang linya. The first method of graphing linear equations is called the slope-intercept method. Ito ay dahil gagamitin natin ang slope at ang y-intercept para mag-graph ang linear equation. First, we need to write the equation in the form y is equal to mx plus b. In this equation, the m refers to the slope of the line and b refers to the y-intercept. Ibig sabihin, kung gagamitin natin yung 3x minus y equals negative 2, kailangan muna nating isalin sa form na y equals mx plus b. Ganito ang paraan para maisulat natin ang 3x minus y equals negative 2 sa slope-intercept form. Ang resulta ay y equals 3x plus 2. This is the form of the equation that we will use. From here, we could already identify the slope and y-intercept of this equation. The slope of the line is equal to 3, or as a fraction, 3 over 1. And the y-intercept is 0, 2. We assume here that the x is 0. Ngayon na alam na natin ang slope at ang y-intercept, pwede na natin i-graph ang linear equation na 3x minus y equals negative 2. Firstly, let's plot the y-intercept 0, 2. Then using the slope, we locate the next point on the line. The slope is 3 over 1 which means that our line rises 3 units and runs 1 unit. Sa madaling sabi, magdadagdag tayo ng 3 units sa y at ng isang unit sa x. Because our first point is 0, 2. We add 1 unit to the x coordinate, 0, and 3 units to the y coordinate, 2 which gives us our next point at 1, 5. Now let us plot the second point, 1, 5. By connecting these two points, we now have the graph of the equation 3x minus y equals negative 2.